This next set of drills involves throwing on the run. And again, it's one of those things that we feel we, we want to do these drills so that we can, can get our players to be a little bit uncomfortable. We want to prepare them for anything that they're going to have to play against, any kind of ball that they're going to have to field over the course of a game or a season. Uh, an example might be a uh, winning run at third and it's a slow roller to the shortstop and she's got to come up and she's got to get rid of that ball and make a play at, at home as quickly as she possibly can. So learning how to make throws on the run, learning how to get their bodies in different positions so that they can make those throws when the it's not just a conventional bend over, field the ball, get your feet set and make a good throw. So we want to work on throws on the run. Okay, so the, the first thing we got to do is that you each need a ball and you're gonna work on just walking walking into it. So it's thinking about the, the, the footwork that goes with it. If I go, if I'm right-handed, and I'm gonna go right, left, and I pick the ball up, and then I'm gonna turn my foot, or actually I don't have to turn my foot, that's outside. So I'm gonna take one more step as the ball's coming up, and then I'm throwing off the opposite foot. That's the idea of being able to throw on a run. Okay, is that we're throwing off the opposite foot, if at all possible. Because you've, you've fielded it, and we don't have the regular time to come up and do shuffle shuffle. The idea is that we gotta be faster. So we're gonna try to do, so what I want you to do to begin with is just set the ball out in front of you, take a couple times through it, and then we'll also roll them and you can run through them. So think about situationally when we might use this, okay? Uh, think about third base, shortstop, slow roller with the game-winning run on third. And we have to throw her out at the plate because the score is tied bottom of the seventh. We have to throw her out and it's a slow roller. We have no choice but to come up, field, and throw on the run because we don't have time to get our feet set. All right? We got speed at third. She's breaking on contact and we gotta be quick, as quick as we possibly can be. So that'd be an example of a situation where we might need to use this. Another example is a slapper, right? You got somebody who just tried to hit five, six hole on you, she squibbed it here, we're coming across. We gotta be fast, cause she's fast. So there's a ball for each of you. Go ahead and just work on it. Just a couple of times as far as working on your footwork, getting that glove, getting the ball in the glove, picked up quickly. Whether it's, whether it's your glove foot or your throwing foot that picks it up, it's gonna either be one step or it's gonna be two steps. 